Okay, today I will want to teach you guys on how to add the inland image in the HTML if you are using view. Okay, for example, right now we have a dust element over here. Basically, I just copy the this component from the Tailwind Tailwind documentation, so it's much easier just to show demo to you guys. And basically, we need to add the image at the top. So if we are using the normal HTML, we can just add the style attributes here. For example, style background image. I think I can I create a new a new class. For example, background image style scope image and background image url and we copy the the path of the of the image the url and that's it okay let's add some uh center the image bg cover b bg center okay this is how you add the background image if you are using the normal html but the problem is we are using Vue.js. how do i get the image from the from the assets folder and pass it or it could be you get the image from your rest api you get the urls so what we should right now is for example first my first example is i want to use this image and pass into these components what i should do is i need to import the asset first for example scribe uh, sorry script uh, actually you the last one maybe you can put the assets file in the public folder but it's not recommended to put all the asset the image into all the public folder since most of them is coming from the api or coming from the culinary and something else so need to export default oops need to import the image first image from assets sorry assets image and cut top dot gpad by the way this at symbol is for the source folder and we add this image data inside the view data binding image okay so let's see what we got in the image I try to print this image as you can see we get the the URL or the path for the image so right now we should pass it into the diff so what we can do right now is we need to move the these selections inside the templates because we cannot pass the variable in the style tags. So we just remove this one. We add the style binding in the in the diff background image by the way if the attribute is have dash for the two letters uh we recommend that we make it a camel camel case background image and url right but the problem is we are passing the variables we cannot pass we cannot pass in the image like this 
because the view uh, assume this is the strings so maybe and now we can use the, the symbol over here the yes six strings encapsulations oops sorry this one the url and we are passing variable over here yep like this so if we have a dollar signs which means that okay this is a variable and the other one is strings and that's it and now we can see that we already passed the path inside the view same things for for example if you have uh, objects for example you have uh, user objects which the prof which the image attributes and the attribute is this URL what you can do is just push the user the image so the same things yeah so that's how you pass the variable in the background in inline background image so yeah thank you guys hope you learned something today